Barry Steele, sales chief at Donlin, says that if you have satisfied productive employees, you're going to have satisfied customers. How do they do it? Donlin's philosophy on, on managing the business is pretty simple, and uh, it begins with our people. Uh, you know, we have a belief that if you have uh, satisfied, productive employees, you're going to have satisfied customers with high levels of satisfaction, and that's going to produce repeat sales. And as any good marketing person would tell you, the, the, the best way to grow your business is don't lose any. And uh, we've been fortunate not to have uh, um, next to zero erosion in our portfolio over the last 10 years. And uh, that, along with signing new business, is really the formula for financial success for an organization. And if you have a, a, a partner of yours who is continually running off business and trying to refill that bucket all the time, you're spending too many of your resources and too much energy and too much time of your people, the people part you mentioned, uh, that you can never really develop anything new. And you know, we constantly are looking at new opportunities to leverage data, to put information in the hands of our clients to make better decisions. And we've been really, really fortunate uh, with the um, high retention rates we've had that we've been able to take all of our energies and reinvest that energy, both financial and, uh, and people, back into our company and to the, uh, uh, to the benefit of our clients, as well as to uh, create new opportunities for us to go into different markets with uh, different industries, different size companies than perhaps we would traditionally have done in the past. And, and our senior leadership team spends an, what a lot of people might consider an inordinate amount of time talking about the small things that we can do. Do they have the right tools? Do they have the right systems? Do they have the right staffing? Do they have the right training? Um, all those things go, come together, but it's not, it's not an event-based activity. You have to live that every day. And no one thing will make a big difference, but if you consistently execute on small things along the way throughout every year and continue to grow and take the feedback from the employees. And we do two surveys with our employee base every year, and we spend a, a, a lot of energy uh, trying to find things that we can do to address the, either the opportunities or the concerns that our employee base might have, and then go back to them and say, hey, how did we do? Did we fix that? Did we improve that area? Did we make your life better? Did we solve a problem for a customer by doing this? And uh, it, it's, it's really been uh, a, a great way to stay connected. Uh, you know, little things like doing lun luncheons with our employees and li with 10 at a time in small groups and they can ask you any question they want to during lunch for the hour, hour and a half. And uh, making sure that you don't have a group of employees uh, that feel disconnected from the direction of the company and disconnected from the, the management team that are making decisions on their behalf on a daily basis. We need their feedback. Without their feedback and knowing what's going on down at the field level with the employees who are touching and working for the customers, uh, you, you can't possibly make as, as great of decisions on the policies and procedures for the company as if you didn't have that opportunity.